Welcome back to Abra Knowledge Channel. We are going to take an exam on design of experiment. It is a part of the Lean Six Sigma, and the core technique it uses is statistic modeling. In the past videos, you will find there are five videos on the design of experiment. This particular exam is if you wanted to see the answers and if you wanted to know more about it, you can go through part five of design of experiment where two example been quoted and all that. Let's proceed further. And all I have to do is I have to give a email ID. I will give like email ID a broad knowledge. Gmail.com and then I'll keep the name and whatever the name you, you keep the same name you are going to get it in the certificate, right? And the, for the certificate, the criteria is minimum 80 percentage you should get it. So let's go further. Identify the factor and response. So first of all, factors mean independent. Factors mean causes. Factors mean input, right? Response mean output. Response is also called dependent factor. And response mean dependent, something dependent. For example, the output will not get created by its own, right? It has to depend on input. So therefore, this is the two basic clarity. So in this, uh, the column A, B, C, D are the blocks. I mean, are the general, and when you say design of experiment, when you do a custom de design, and this is a four column will come up. And in this case, so the define, the order system and pack are the one which are the factor. And the R's are, which is nothing but response. So we'll see order system is a factor and pack is another factor second factor ours is response right let's go to the next question okay the next question is how many levels and factors as you can see that factor i already explained that order system is a factor pack is a one factor how many levels when you say levels it can be many uh, in this particular case we have current is one new this is two level and then in pack a and b we have right so that means almost like two levels we have and two factors we have if you could remember the formula that run equal to if you wanted to know how many runs you need to take that the formula is l the power of f right L is number of level. In this case, levels are two, right? And then the power of F, the factors. This is one factor, this is one factor. So four, right? So that means minimally, if you take that one, this one, minimally you need to have one, minimum one factor. I mean, minimum four runs you need to have. Sorry, minimum four runs you need to have. So this is how you need to understand this. So in this case, the answer is two levels we have and two factors we have. Two levels include order system and pack. Two factors include uh, the, no, current and new. In other words, when you say from pack perspective, A and B. Let's go to the next question. Third question we are moving. And this is also an interesting one, connecting the dot. As in this example, time, temperature, and catalyst. So these three are factors, and the response is only one, but it is being taken in different uh, subgroups. For example, subgroup one, two, three, and all the way to eight, but only one called eight. So factor time is one factor, temperature is another factor, catalyst another factor, yield one to eight. We have eight subgroups but it's only one response, right? And another one is run order. As we said in the in the previous video, I talked about more in detail. Run order, standard order, center point, and blocks are not the, uh, neither response nor the, nor the factor. Okay, we are moving to the fourth question. And what is the path? What is the path when, when we can get that response optimizer. This is the way we need to do. First, we need to go to Minitab DOE. First, we have to perform the custom, define custom factorial. Then you have to do an analyze. And then the last, you will get it three, right? So this is the right answer. And uh, so directly, you can't go to uh, response optimizer because it will show incorrect. 
and you can't go directly here also as well for response optimizer and no because it will many time will not show that and analyze and response yet another we cannot do so the right answer is this one right so i'm going to click that also as well can we get a free sample within Minitab? Yes, we can easily get it. So how to do? That question is coming up next. Uh, what is a path to get the access to free sample folder within, sample, uh, within Minitab? Very easy, free. Minitab, open worksheet, and there is a down, there is something called look in Minitab sample data folder, and you will you'll have a more than more folders and files, more than 100 files and uh, examples are available. You can make use of it. If you want to know more about it, you can go to the previous uh, video. I'll keep this in the description so that you can take a look. Why up the response optimizer is disabled is because as I said that this is this question is linked to this question. And first you need to do the define custom. Then analyze, then respond. So this is the reason why it is being disabled because we have not done the analyze, we are not done the define. That's the reason. And even if you refresh, this will not so, uh, solve the problem. And uh, it is it it has a mistake. For example, we have to do first define custom, then analyze factorial design, then this will open up. Okay, what to choose? Like in this case, let's say order system and pack, and we have an order system and pack. Uh, as you can recall that in the previous uh, question, it is there. If you look at here, order system and uh, in a pack. So this is you have a combination of current and new. You can see the spelling. The capital C is there, the capital N is there, E and B is the capital, right? But in the questions, it is been twisted. Okay. I will I will just uh, give you that answer. I will I'll come to that. This is the answer. I'll give an option because actually like here the current spelling is here. It is here in capital and A is in a uh, cap here capital here is small. Sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, this is one of the reason. Let's go back to the previous one. I just uh, skip in order to have the continuations and in this case. Uh, so whenever you deal with the text like discrete right current and new and all that so uncoded you can tell. Let's go to the next question and according to this paradox, what is important factor is E and B both are important factor because you can see that 2.306 and E and B are both important factor. And let's go to the next questions. Next question is very interesting question. And I'll make it small slightly smaller so that you can see the screen. What is not part of the DOE? Select from the options, right? Tagochi is a part of the DOE. When you say Tago DOE, uh, the next term comes out is that Tagochi model. Anuva, of course, is a part of uh, DOE because you can do a main interaction and uh, main effect plot, interaction plot, and all that. Factorial plot, that one which we did it, define custom factorial and an analyze and response optimizer and all that. The scatter is not directly part of it, although in the regression, some part we use it. Uh, and it is not associated with the DOE. MSA, of course, both MSA, when you say GRR and attribute agreement analysis, it's not part of it. And process capability is not part of it. So these three are the answer. Okay, let's go to the one. This is interesting, yet another interesting question. In this is part the error, and in order system, when order system is there, and then you have run order, you have run order, center points, it has been given as blocks. In blocks, it has been given center point. So this is interchange is the mistakes here. So blocks and center points are interchange. Let's go to the next question. What is the recommended settings to have to have to get the maximum field? So maximum yield. So in, if you get that, it has been set as a maximum. In order to get the maximum, again, we have eight. Uh, in this particular example, we have eight, four, five, six, seven, eight and many so generally speaking that uh, we have to keep it like 50 171 and yay 50 is time should be 50 and temperature should be 171.9 and this one so this should be the right answer and uh, let's go to the next question what is the recommended setting to have that to get the less time per minute so many uh, less time so we have to have a other system as a new pack should be b 
order system should be new and pack should be p. The next question. What is the shortest way to manage the multiple responses is a given picture could be viable option. Yes. So as I said that the response is only one we have in, in this case there are three factors we have time temperature and catalyst only one response we have so if you can do a find out you can do a mean you can do a standard deviation find out whether we can do and when it is available and of course you have to do a normality test and all that in the past video i talked about it but the answer is yes one of the one of the easiest way to do it since the normality of the data shows uh, uh, normal and it is p value is greater than five percentage and that's the reason we can take that uh, uh, mean also as well let's go to the next one and this is extra marks you will get it and is there any videos related to DOE nabra knowledge channel and this is the link is being given here yes yes there are many things are being taught on this so so you can give more than four videos are being kept so you can submit so you can also view the score. You can also take another response also as well. Let me just see that response and 50 out of 50. I've got it and then email ID and uh, the certificate will be get generating and you can see here all these factors being correct. The first question identify the factors and expand. This is correct and how many levels and factor. This is perfect and then identify the factors and response and uh, this we got it connecting the dot and how to find the path we got it and can we access the free sample within mini tap yes what's the path to get the free sample we got it why response optimum disable we got it and then how to choose and all that how to select the code and uncode it and spot the errors and and then we got this one according to Pareto what is the important factor Pareto uh, in this case, what is not associated with this one? We also discuss this also as well. And then you have a spot the error we discuss and then what is the recommended, uh, recommended uh, settings and then all these we have got it. So and then let's see our certificate so you can just open up this one. We also got the certificate also as well. Let, let's say that whatever the name you give, it will come here. I have given Abra knowledge channel. So it Abra knowledge came. Design of experiment statistic quiz and we got 100 and the passing criteria is 80 percentage. This is a certificate number. This also comes with the date and so on and so forth. Right. So thank you so much. Please do like share subscribe my channel. You have wonderful day. I have.